belong. Um, yeah, like somewhere to just exist. Um, and space doesn't necessarily have to be safe, but I would hope it would be safe. And that's what, you know, I wish for uh, when I think about space. But space could literally be on, it could be like, you know, in the tram, it could be like in your room, in your home, or if you go somewhere uh, in the city. Like everything is space. And um, some spaces are you know, owned by other people, some spaces are only for you, yeah, some spaces you feel more welcome than others. So yeah, just thinking about like where I grew up, I grew up in and like there there were people like from different you know backgrounds and countries and I just remember like being very free it was a lot of like grass green spaces and like we were just like kids when I was 12 I moved to like an area where it's not mixed like not different backgrounds everyone's like white Swedish and there if it was more stiff you know it wasn't I didn't feel as free, and um, there were there because uh, I still live there, so you don't really you know say hi to people, kind of like look down, and yeah, I, I don't feel, or at first I didn't feel like I fit in. It it's more it has to do more with the the knowledge that I have. It's not so much the spaces, it's more that I know now how I'm viewed by others. So that's why whenever I enter somewhere, I scan the room and then I think, can I be myself? Can I not be myself? How should I talk? How should I act? You know, what's expected of me? It's more that than this actual space. Mm. And Or if I go to a space and I see, you know, that it's all white, then I know, okay, this is how I do it here. Or if I go somewhere that's not Sweden, and I feel like, oh, there's more black people here, then I feel like I can be myself more. For sure, like whenever I'm planning anything or if I'm inviting people to my home or if I'm inviting people to do anything I always want it to be like I want you to come in and feel welcomed I want people to feel like okay someone actually thought about this this is not like last minute there is an idea a thought about everything and I want it to be an experience and I want it to feel safe and warm when I go to spaces here, sometimes I'm not even greeted or there's no smile and then I just feel like, well, let me just go home then because maybe I wasn't welcomed, you know? So for me, that's, that's important. I'm thinking like the only places where I've like been invited, invited, it's like maybe, you know, like someone's birthday party or like Nigerian party sometimes or like church or temple, you know, those spaces. But when it comes to like events, here in town, I wouldn't necessarily say, like, I mean, it's open for everyone, right? It's on Facebook, but then I've gone and then I don't know anyone or I just, I can just feel something in my body and that's enough for me to not want to go. Growing up, feeling unseen and like, mm, yeah, sometimes I feel like I could be a ghost because no one's, you know how it's, you, you, people don't say anything, they don't look at you, you know, we just move like as if we're, we're not even touching each other, it's, it's just so weird, sometimes I think about it and I'm like, it's so scary. So the reason why I try to do what I can 
to create spaces for people to come and see people who look like, like them is for the reason, like I don't want anyone to feel what I've felt. Thank you.